We're gonna be eating at Ikea for the next 24 hours. I'm so excited. I've actually never had Ikea food. We're definitely new to Ikea eating. We got a wrap, which doesn't look too bad, and then we got a salad. All right, guys, check these fingers out. Not bad for Ikea. This is a 10 out of 10. No way. This is a solid chicken finger. Good Show us what tonight. you got. All right, what do you on. think? Is it? Good. Really, really good. It's really good. Scott fam, Scott fam, what is going on? What is going on? Welcome back to our channel, guys. And if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button, join the Scott family. And in today's video, guys, we're gonna be eating at Ikea for the next 24 hours. I'm so excited. I've actually never had Ikea food. No? No, have you? Never have, this is gonna be the first time. I'm so excited, mainly because I will never forget when I first moved to LA. I had no job yet, like I was getting stuff figured out. On the ground. And one of the first places I wanted to go to was Ikea, because everybody knows Ikea has like cute furniture at great prices. So we walk in, and the first thing I see is they have a sign that's like hot dogs for like 50 cents, like something what a steal. crazy. I know, and I was like, okay, now I know where to go. If all if fails, I'm going to rough, Ikea. I'm going to Ikea. Yeah, <laughs> I love so that. Not I finally get to try possibly an Ikea hot dog. I don't know what I'm gonna get you for lunch, like but. You might love it. Yo, you might wanna come I, back I, tomorrow. I got nothing against a good glizzy. A good glizzy. <laughs> Like I hold nothing against a good The Glizzy, glizzy. Gang, you just <laughs> joining the crew? Are you gonna get a hot dog up there right now? Maybe, I don't know, I don't know. There oh, might what? be better options. Okay. I don't wanna put myself there. That's but. so funny. So we just got to Ikea. We're about to go inside right now and we're gonna be eating their breakfast, lunch, and dinner, ladies and gentlemen. We'll see you inside Ikea. All right guys, we are just getting to the Ikea food court and it doesn't look like a bad selection. The seating is... It's so nice. It has like a really cool view of the pumpkin patch, which is cool. And the mountains. And the mountain. So, where do we get food? All right, guys, so I think right here is you just open it up and wrap the food you want. Oh, my Yo, I think I want that wrap. That wrap looks amazing. That does look so I might do like a wrap right now, because it's wow. it's kind of afternoon, it's just like 11, 12 o'clock. Look at this. And then, you yeah, look. literally just open it. And then and there's wrap the food. what you want. Do we need like a tray or anything? I don't know. We're, we definitely, we're definitely new to Ikea eating. <laughs> we're gonna grab a tray, we're gonna get the food that we want, and then we'll see you at the table. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, we're at our table. Yeah. This is what we ended up getting. We got a wrap, which doesn't look too bad, and then we got a salad. A Greek salad, which looks delicious. It looks delicious. And then so, if you look out here, look how gorgeous. it's got a dope view of Vegas. It's actually not a bad spot to eat. No, it's really pretty. Look at baby, I brought you with an amazing view just for you, my love. Oh, <laughs> romantic date. I'm curious, how much was this? It was 11 bucks. That's good. That's not bad. Not bad at all. So a salad and a wrap, we're gonna split both of these things because yeah. we're not starving. So let's try it out. All right, Tyler's going in for the salad. Let me know how it tastes, my love. First, mm. the dressing, all over the top of it like that. What kind of dressing is that? I'm, I'm assuming it's a Greek salad one. Greek salad? like a vinaigrette, smells really good. Okay. And I love that it doesn't have olives. Oh, thank God it doesn't have olives. have olives. In them. Oh. Mm. What do you think? Scale of one to 10, give me a rating. That is a solid 7.5. 7.5 yeah, from really Ikea salad? Yeah. Okay, bomb. cool, I'm gonna try the wrap. All right guys, the wrap presentation doesn't look bad. I'm gonna wrap kind of bad. <laughs> <laughs> Is it good? Not bad. What is it? Let me see. Ooh, so we got some chicken, some cheese, some the lettuce. Dressing in there's really good too. Ooh, that Honestly, looks bomb. For IKEA, I'm gonna say this is like 6.5 seven. Yeah, looks good. Digging into the chicken a little bit in the wrap, it's a little chewy. It's kind of like the only really thing that's kind of throwing me off. It's really good. The flavor is amazing. Because sometimes wraps can be dry. Yeah. It's just a little chewy. I'm still gonna eat it because it's got. <laughs> It's got the throats in it, but a little chewy chicken. A little chewy. No good. All right, guys, so I'm starting to think that Roger's just up to no good. He said he had to go to the bathroom, but it's literally been like 10 minutes. I'm like, okay, I'm gonna go on a mission and try to find him. Oh, how cute. All right, we're in Vegas. Okay, where is Roger? Stop for <laughs> What are you doing? <laughs> so you found a bed and you're sleeping? <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Alright guys, that was hilarious. We will see you at lunchtime. 
No more naps in Ikea. Let's see if we can find some cute stuff. Uh, honestly, we'll do some but the bed was so comfortable. Was it really? I could easily take a nap. Hey, uh, you guys know we need a dresser, so maybe we should go look and see if there's some dresses. Is that what you want to do? Yeah, let's go see. I didn't sign up for this, guys. <laughs> I didn't sign up to shop. I didn't sign up to shop. See you at lunch. Ikea. We are back. We are back. And we are back for lunch. All right, so update. We didn't have any luck on a dresser. There is one that we've had our eye on for so long. It's so cute, but the problem is that they never, ever have it in stock. Never. So, I don't know, maybe one of these days we'll just order it, but it takes like three months, and then we're always like, we're gonna find something in between those three months. Yeah. And we never do. And we never do. <laughs> but it just feels like a commitment, you know? Yeah. But guys, we're coming back for lunch. I think we're both gonna split the chicken fingers. Yeah, that sounds good. The chicken fingers really look good. And Talia. Wait, they also had a soup too. Maybe we can get soup and chicken fingers. I might do soup for dinner. Oh! Soup for dinner sounds nice. Yeah. Soup for dinner and then maybe chicken fingers right now. Yeah, that sounds good. So we, now we know where everything's at. We know where to get the tray. It's kind of like we're official. Yeah, Ikea. we kind of like got it down now. Yeah, we got it down. Okay, so we get some chicken fingers. Cafeteria vibes, we're back. That Look at you. You're the cafeteria queen back in the day. You were stunting in that cafeteria. I'm definitely a hot lunch kind of girl. A hot lunch? Yeah, I didn't like to bring lunch. That's the whole story. Really? I didn't like sandwiches for lunch because like warm mayo and warm ham just grossed me out. Oh. So I only wanted peanut butter and jelly, but my mom always put too much jelly and my dad always put too much peanut butter. And I was like, y'all, you guys can't figure this out. I'm doing hot lunch. All right guys, check these fingers out. Not bad for Ikea. We got a four finger combo with so some good. french fries. If anybody knows what a good chicken finger is, is this lady right here, Italia. She's a queen in a lot of things. She's a Starbucks queen and she is the chicken finger queen as well, if you guys Smells were curious. Great. Smell test, passes the test. Okay. How's the crunch? How's the finger? Would you come back for more? What is the rating? Whatever's that. Would you? This is a 10 out of 10. No way. This is a solid chicken finger. 10 out of 10? Wow. Dude, that's a solid rating. Are you serious? This is great. I'm 10 out of 10. I'm pumped about that. Alright, I gotta try this chicken finger. Let me see this finger. So you gave this a 10 out of 10. It's honestly so good. That is serious business right now. It's like nice and peppery, like it is so good. I would come back for these. 100%. I would come back for these. The wrap, I'm not sure. But the chicken fingers? Absolutely. Some good chicken fingers. No, right I agree. They're I would so say, good. I'm not going to give it a 10 out of 10 because there's always room for improvement. True. Nine. I'm going to give it a solid nine. The salt on it too is like not too much. No, it's perfect. Wow, Ikea has perfected the chicken. <laughs> Who knew? Who knew? And right. the french fries. Try the french fries. How the french fries? So good. Are they? They're like nice and crispy on the outside, but like really soft on the inside. Like it's important. That's important. So good. See if you'll focus in on that French fry right there. Oh, it's like a glowing French fry. Oh, whoa. Going in for the ranch? Let's try. It. I'm surprised you didn't start with the ranch. I'm picky with my ranch. I don't know about this guy. He looks like a trustworthy guy. He's got a cowboy hat on. Mm. Good to go. Newman? Yo, I grew up with Newman my whole life. <laughs> Are you serious? Never Yo, heard of it. Newman dressings are bomb on everything. It's really good. I swear, my family and I grew up with that our entire life. Okay. Newman's Ranch, Newman Caesars. I it was, get it because it's really good. So the chicken fingers are 10 out of 10 for Talia. Yes, I am feasting. I'm this at a is, nine. This is solid. This is everything you wanted and more. Mm -hmm. Well, cool. <laughs> solid lunch at Ikea, I think. From Ikea, probably cruise home, Hi, hang out, right? chill, and then come back a little later yeah. for dinner. Very right, cool. Well, we're gonna dig into these chicken fingers, guys. If you want chicken fingers, come to Ikea, because they are the bomb.com, mm -hmm. some would say. Bounce. Check it out. Last and final meal. I have a request. Okay, what's your request? So we're gonna go and have the soup. Okay. I also wanna grab the cinnamon bun downstairs and bring it up for dessert. Cinnamon bun. Yeah. All right, so we'll go downstairs, grab what we need to grab. Yeah, and then go upstairs. Cool, let's do it. Okay. There it is, Talia. Lizzy, are you ready for that? You know what I'm ready for is that cinnamon roll. That looks fire cane. It does look 10 out of 10. Flames are everywhere. Let's get it. Now that is a steal, ladies and gentlemen. The cinnamon right. rolls at Ikea are only a dollar. That's crazy. No. <laughs> I'm gonna be back here every day. I love cinnamon rolls. <laughs> date night, come here. Date right. night at Ikea. <laughs> it's been kind of like a date day. Right? Dude, this is great. Thank you. Oh, there it is. Ooh, Yummy. look at that baby right there. Yeah, These look good. All right, let's head upstairs. Yo, really? Are those cinnamon rolls right there? Yeah. Cinnabons ready to bake. Ready to go. Ikea's just doing it, ladies and gentlemen. They are doing it. I can't wait to try this. It looks so good. It's warm. Mm. Mm. All right, babe. Good Show us tonight. what you got. All right, so Whoa. remember the tomato soup that we thought was tomato soup? Yes. It's not tomato soup, it's tahini. 
or something like that. Oh, okay. So this honestly looks like a big plate though. It's like no, eight meatballs. This looks amazing. We got potatoes, mashed potatoes? Mashed potatoes. <gasps> My favorite. Broccoli, some yams, or not yams, I, I, cranberry or something like okay. that. Okay. And the famous um, meatballs. The famous meatballs. The Swedish famous meatballs. Oh, um, we are about to see right And honestly, guys, we ate here all day. It was $130. That's so I think good. This was like $5.99 or like what? six bucks or something like that. It was so cheap. That's insane. Yeah, it's absolutely insane. That's insane. Wow. Yeah, for freaking $5.99 for dinner. Oh, good tonight, ladies and gentlemen. I'm trying with you. All right, let's try it. What do you oh, think? Is it? Good. Is that sauce just gravy or this does right that here? come with this the, is No, not that, like the brown sauce. The brown sauce is the gravy. Oh. It's the gravy, mashed potatoes, the broccoli. Excuse me, balls are hit. Potatoes, I'm going in. <laughs> Scrum Dilliumptious. Not bad. Wow. And the last and final thing, the broccoli. Yummy. Nice and big. Mmm, it looks soft. Like a good steamed broccoli. It tastes like broccoli. <laughs> Are you ready to try it? Are I'm ready. Try it? Wait, wait, wait. What's your rating? Scale of 1 to 10. I'm yeah. going to give this a solid, probably 7.5. Whoa, that's solid. So, it's not bad. Yeah. It's not bad. All right, let's try it. It's a price. Everything just matches. <laughs> All right, baby, what are you going in for first? Some mashed potatoes. Mashed potatoes? What do you think? It's wow. not bad, right? That is a good mashed potato. The gravy's really I good. I love mashed potatoes, and I have to say, that is great. Okay, now we're going in for the meatball. The meatball, the Swedish famous meatball. That's really good. It's good, right? Mm. It doesn't taste like our like the same meatball that we usually get. I've never had a meatball like this. It still tastes really good. I love it. It tastes really, really good. So it's made out of uh, beef and pork, I believe. Mm. Mm -hmm. Really, really it's good. It's really good. Bomb flavor. Broccoli. The best part, get your veggies in. Yeah, I like love that meatball. It's really good, huh? It's really good. All right, the broccoli. Can't go it's wrong. Solid. It's a good meal, guys. Ikea, you're doing dinner right. Now, what would you rate this on a scale of I'm 1 to 10? Easy, 7.5. 7.5. It's really good. And you can't beat the price. Mm -hmm. The price is like, that's amazing. The fact that we were able to eat breakfast, lunch, and dinner here. Under $30. Under $30. We haven't tried the cinnamon roll. We haven't tried the cinnamon roll. All right, full prezzo of that. It looks good. That was bomb. It's kind of iffy, though, because the frosting's kind of throwing me off. Okay. I don't know if it's going to be good or not, because usually I'm used to, like, it's smothered on it. Yeah. So it's like, is it really going to live up to the classic cinnamon roll that we love? We're about to find out. We're about to find out. Let me know. Is it pretty good? Is it pretty good? That's a good cinnamon roll. <laughs> no. Y'all, that Never is, judge a book by its cover. That is a good cinnamon roll. It's good. Is it the best cinnamon roll I've ever had? Probably not. No, but it's really good. But for coming to Ikea, if you just get done shopping and you want like, hey, that looks kind of good, I'm going to grab that on the way out because we got that downstairs. I definitely recommend it. 100%. Compared to like Cineholic, can't compare. Like we've had really good cinnamon rolls. I would probably give that a six. I'm going to be a little tougher on that one. Okay, let me check. Let me give you another bag. Oh, the middle? Because it's always the softest. You know it's good in the middle. That. Okay, going in. I'm staying with my score, six. Okay. What'd you give it? I'm gonna give it... Don't I'm gonna say like a 7.5. Seven. seven, okay, you're being generous. Seven, seven point five. Okay. No, I think it's good. Of course, he's comparing it to like this place that has the most insane cinnamon whoa, rolls whoa, whoa, ever. Whoa, whoa, guys. When you know something good, you know something <laughs> good, right? You're not wrong And I'm not that. settling for anything less. I want nothing but the best. Overall though, Ikea, the food was amazing all day. For under $30, you cannot beat it. And it's fun because you get to just like explore. Ikea is so big. There's so, big. so many things to see in this store. So you get to have a good time. It's, it's kind of funny. When we walked into it, there was only one entrance and like one exit. So you have to go through Ikea. Great marketing. Great marketing, Ikea. Because we were like going through like, oh, we can get that. Oh, we can get that. We're looking at dressers again. We're doing all kinds of it. All kinds of stuff. Honestly, I could spend a lot of time here. And now that I know we can eat, I mean, I've always kind of known that, but I've never actually like taken the time to sit down and try the food. But now that we know, I can see us now spending gonna a sleep lot here. more time here. We should do the overnight challenge of Ikea. That would be so cool. Sleeping here. Dude, how do people do that? I don't know. We're going to find out. figure that out. I would man. love to sleep in Ikea. Maybe we'll do that in the video. That would be sick. All right, guys. Well, it's the end of the vlog. We hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, give it a big thumbs up. But before we conclude the video, we need to do our post notification shout out. And that goes to... Intuitive Muffin. That's your YouTube name. I don't know your real name, but I want to thank you so much for being a part of the Scott fam. We love you. 
And if you want a post notification shout out, all you have to do is make sure that you are subscribed to our channel, that you turn your post notifications on, and that you comment when you've done those things. All right guys, make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Tell your friends and family about the Scott family. Love you guys. Love you guys, see you next video. Peace.